Previously on Welcome to the Family. Dude, you're not supposed to do that. To a doctor's grand opening. We bring the patients in here to do exercise. This port is the Botox, basically. It's the same anabotulin toxin A. And guess who the victim was? Anyone can entertain you, but only we entertain you. With a mixture of fun, learning, and craziness, my team and I travel the world motivating and connecting with people. Are you ready? Welcome to the family. Now, how many units of dice sport would you use on him? Well, it depends which area he wants to do. Show me. The whole face. The whole face. <laughs> okay, and what you're trying to achieve, just smoothing the wrinkles, which you don't practically have. You have very few. Yes, they all dynamic wrinkles. That's the one that can be removed with botulinum toxin. Okay. Thank you, and relax. Yes. It was painful. You could feel the needle going in and you feel like a liquid, like... <laughs> it was weird. He doesn't have any lines on the top, so basically prophylactically, I'm gonna give him one unit in this side, one unit in this side. But like one or two of the shots were like painful. <laughs> we have to stay outside the area. You see the difference? <laughs> not really. Well, she says it would take three days and I look a lot younger. So by the time you're watching this and you see me again, I'll be 25. Always at these events, there's one main thing that I love. You know, meeting new people is great, but the food, come on, come on. I love meeting new food. <laughs> so they had this uh, raffle going on when you first signed up and guess what? We didn't just win one, we won two raffles. Apparently LJ and Bert both won the raffle. I won Botox, guys. No, you won B12 shots. There was a group of women and the two men there won. Now, is that amazing? LJ got four shots of B12 shots. Mm -hmm. I'm not hyper enough. I'm gonna take it away from LJ because he doesn't need it. He's 22 years old. Mr. Bert over here won the six sessions of laser ear removal. Small area, it has to be a small area. Six. Because it like her. <laughs> <laughs> and we hit it off. I mean, completely. She is fabulous. So definitely, you'll probably be seeing more of Cindy. So I recently came to the market for a new car. And it feels like we've been car shopping for the past several months. All we did is go car shopping. And I was searching online, looking around, and found this Mini Cooper. If you remember a couple episodes down, we actually went to look at Minis. Minis are really nice cars. In fact, I didn't think they were that nice, but once we got in it, I was like, wow, this is a real nice car. Thank you guys for coming with me. Ah, man, yeah. I'm talking about it. I'm Mellow. No, you're excited. I'm excited. I'm Cautiously excited. The only one little snag was the fact that it was a stick shift, which I don't know how to drive. I wish I could test drive. <laughs> well, we are. Yeah, I know. It's just gonna be funny. Hi, I'm gonna be the one that's flying, but I can't drive it. Cause I'm rich like that. <laughs> <laughs> so Eric is very frugal, for the lack of better words, and he had a budget. And because he's that organized and that anal retentive, we had to make sure that we stay within budget. Look at these classics, man. Yeah. Look at that. Yeah, maybe you should buy one of those. Oh my God, that's beautiful. So one of the more fun things that we do here, not that everything we do isn't fun, but one of the things that I really like doing now is networking. When you find a good networker where you have true people there that are actually there looking for real connections real business opportunities. It's great because you get to meet interesting people and you get to see how you can work together. Recently, Alex and I went to a Miami Beach Chamber of Commerce event. We are in South Beach, where you always see from movies. This the is the Mecca. Too many tourists, but you know, it's one of those places you have to come at least once in your life. Dude, Look, that's the where Miami they filmed um, Scarface. Mercedes, 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 Mercedes. And we're looking for a BMW. We went to a Mercedes dealership. And if you've ever been to one, they're really, really, really nice. Whatever you want to drink, whatever you want to eat, you know, of course, you're planning to buy an expensive car, so they got to treat you different. Test drive for the Mini Cooper. Sure, do you need this? Eric Munter. Look at your little smile, I see you. It was definitely the fish out of the water. There we go. That was nice, that was good. 
It didn't feel right, but I could see how it could possibly grow on me. Oh, it's that easy. I like it. Yeah. And I want it to be your choice. Yeah, I like it. Look, it has a backup. I think these are the sensors. Ah, cool. It was strange not being able to test drive the car I was interested in buying. The first time in my life ever have I seen someone take a test drive in the passenger seat. <laughs> I don't know what it is, I can put my finger on it, but it's not, I don't know, price obviously is a little, I just, it can go down a little bit more, but. Price is great though. Yeah, price is great. After the test drive, I was still on the fence about it, I wasn't completely sold. I guess the, the big thing that was sort of holding me back was it was a convertible, which I know a lot of people, you're probably thinking, well, what's wrong with that? That's great. I, I, I don't know. It didn't feel safe at first to me, so that was sort of holding me back a little bit. And of course, the number one factor was the fact that it was a stick shift and really wasn't all that interested in learning how to drive a manual car. No, I was just thinking but about that's it. That's the way. He's, he's, it's the same thing Valerie went through. It's buyer's remorse. You finally get it and you're like, yeah. I'm not sure. Yeah. So. Are you call and schedule right now? Yeah, let me see. Oh, we can just drop by. We can drop by. Where is it at? Let me see. We're going to try to look at another car. It's a different dealer. So it's just a matter of what's not selling you in the car. I think that might be it. That's it? Well, that and the... The back seat? The, no, well, the back seat's kind of... I'm not going to be sitting back there. That is annoying, but... Well, at 35 miles a gallon, it's not that annoying. Yeah, that is nice. <laughs> Eric had a list of different dealerships he wanted to go to. So we told the Mercedes people to hold on to the car and if they were able to give us a better deal, we will actually come back and buy the car. It's harder for you to have an accident because you're always focus. working. Yeah, you're, you're working, you're using your brain. You don't get into that like, oh, well, it's like a motorcycle. Yeah. And it's convertible, dude. And it's beautiful. And your abortion or whatever, he's going <laughs> to love it. You're yeah, going to disconnect. When you get all frustrated and shit, you need to take a cruise all over that convertible, you're yeah. done. Yeah, that's gonna be it's therapy. It's like LJ and I, when we get on those bikes, it's therapy. Dude, we rode the other day, we're like, what? Five miles? And we had a blast. Mm -hmm. That's it. <laughs> that was it. Just enough. Yeah, that's yeah. the thing I love about the motorcycle. Any ride is a good ride. It was so much fun that we saw this this man just having the time of his life out on the dance floor. We're gonna have to get up in the morning. Anyway, this is what you gotta do when you wanna build your business, right? You have to go out to these networkers, find ballet or find parking somewhere, and then situate yourself and uh, register, and then you end up coming out to these places and meeting people. It's one of the essential things we do. And yeah, there's usually food, there's usually liquor. Is it good? We went from a Mercedes dealership, which was very nice, to another dealership that was in a bit of a sketchy neighborhood. Definitely not a Mercedes dealership. I'm afraid they're gonna steal our car. Hey guys, this is Eric from Welcome to the Family. And don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Hey. Ah, and don't forget also to share this video with your friends and family. Sorry. <laughs>